Now, for your pasta large, measure 1000 grams of icing sugar or confectioner sugar into a big bowl. I am using my scale for this. Again, measure 3 level tablespoon of tylose and half teaspoon of tylose in a different bowl and then pour it into the icing sugar in a bigger bowl. Make sure it's leveled. Do not heap it as it will affect your recipe. The water you will be using for this recipe is hot water. It will be hot but not too hot that you cannot put your hand in it. We call it tepid water. Not too hot and not cold. Take note of that. Now set aside the flat plate and then mix in the tylos. Now you will be measuring half cup of water and two tablespoons of water. But you are going to be adding the two tablespoons later. Why didn't I add it together? It is because all icing sugar are not the same. Some of the icing sugar requires more water and some of them don't. That is why in some cases, after using the same recipe, you find out that the dough is not giving you the same texture. In most cases, it may require lesser water. So for this reason, you don't add all of them at a time. So I've added one tablespoon extra and I am adding the second one tablespoon. Continue mixing until everything is mixed together. Gather everything on the work table and mix in. Next, sprinkle a little corn flour. It can be one tablespoon, which I've written there. It can be lesser. And then smoothing out your pastelage. Knead the pastelage for at least three more minutes. Wrap it up if you're not ready to use it or use immediately.